Hey, what's up, guys, and welcome to Good Times with Toby Coon. I'm your host, Toby Coon. You guys are having an awesome day out there. I hope your uh, weekend was great. I enjoyed the uh, short work week, but of course, we're back to the long work week again. So, as for myself, it's been a good start. I uh, can't complain. It was raining momentarily outside, a little bit of wind, but now it's calmed down. It just pretty much made a mess of the yard once again. So, back to yard work during the weekend or do anything else. All right, today, guys, we're going to be playing a game called uh, Dark Tales from the Lost Soul. Of course, this is a Japanese exclusive. It would be a pretty cool game. Again, this is a first time for me. It's going to be probably a first time for most of you, unless you are around and watch it on YouTube. But otherwise, this is going to be an awesome playthrough. So, be ready. Be ready to be amazed. Uh, be ready to be, be dumbfounded or. Let's be ready to be like, what did we just play? What did we just go through for a whole amount of time? So, without further ado, let's go start it with Dark Tales from the Lost Soul for the PS1. Alright, so Dark Tales from the Lost Soul. It's basically, a, like I said before, it is a Japanese exclusive game. This was released back on October 28, 1999. It was all the Cool games came out in 99 for some reason, not much for 98. Then again, I hold 98 to my heart. Basically, this is a pretty cool game. It's virtually short stories. So you're playing the protagonist, you're playing a... Uh, basically, playing three short stories. Each has a different protagonist. The game itself is pretty dark. Um, as you as you'll see in a bit, it has its own little style. It has its own little uh, flavor of play. But as we get through it all, it's going to be pretty cool just to run through it, go through a couple of you know, stages. They are short. These stages are supposed to be short, so we'll attempt to complete one, two, three, depending on how long it takes. Uh, let's see what, see how it goes. Let's go ahead and boot up the good old PlayStation One. Maybe get started. All right, so let's get started. Let's see the intro like we always do. Take a little bit of time, okay? Company made by Sammy. Where Sammy presents. And Sammy has love pride. Vertex Zero Production. Let's do Cat and Mouse. That's what kind of got, that's what got me interested in it, so let's do Cat and Mouse. Goraijo no minasama, the Lost Soul niokoshi itadaki, 
。誠にありがとうございます。私が案内役のテラーでございます。以後、お見知りをきよう。さてお待ちかねの余興が今宵も始まりますご来場の皆様には大切な思い出の品を一つお持ちいただいていると思いますがおやグローブですかいいですねスポーツは。やりすぎはいけませんねボールに血がにじんでますよそちらのご婦人は鳥かごですか曲線が美しいですね肝心の小鳥はどうしたんですか。可愛い,い人形ですね。ピエロですか。私面白い話を知っています殺人鬼を追い詰める刑事さんの話なんですがね<笑>失礼最初の要求はこの話にしましょうミュージック This guy's got a strong influence. Kind of like David Lynch's Twin Peaks in the sense. Kind of reminds me of that. Let's see where it goes. Let's see how this goes. I'm gonna go to Christmas for these really bad ones. To another headlight course. We have this course to score. We have this course for a team victim despite the sensory control. I guess you guys. Days of. どこに行きやがったんだ
下は定年退職だってのにとんでもねえ山へ行ちまったぜ、うん、鍵を拳銃で吹っ飛ばすかそれとも僕は携帯で応援を行くかどっちにしろやつを逃がすわけにはいかねえ Choose your own adventure style. It's a classic cell phone there, guys. Back in the day. Oh, Orda! Daishiki Owen Tanum! Coco! Anda! Tanjima to be sincere to me! Maddening masks. Red and black. Red and white. This is more mental, so it's more mental thinking. Which is always the best course of action at this point. So, we'll find out.
Or something. Let's go play land here. So, what would you do with a killer or a western playland? 
新聞の切れっ端ジエクスプレス相当古いもんだな1955年12月24日イブの3時観覧車炎上うん肝心の記事が切り取られてるじゃねえかマスクの方はおお自由かキャッチトゥガンテンペスト Yeah, where you're just crazy maniacs hiding. Yeah, keep finding them. Now we're gonna go to Tempest. Whatever type of right Tempest is. Tempest. Oh man, what's going to happen? Curious, curious, it gets around here. Jetoko Saga. Chase. Oh, maybe he did. Maybe not. <laughs> And yet, there's no save point. <laughs>
All right, we got him, guys. Took a little bit of time, but we got him. Usta! Usta! Yarujata! Yarpazo! Killer. Zuzaroi! Inezo! Gotta follow this trail of blood. Tail or trail here. You got gotcha, you, killer. Splash time. Come on, you. I'm a kite and move. Look out. A ferris wheel. Get one horse. I'm a little tiny. Nanka hot dog.新聞記事。さっき見つけたキレッパシの続きか。新聞記事。えっと、昨夜7時半頃、3人家族を乗せた観覧車のゴンドラが突然炎上。消防活動を虚しく乗っていた家族のうち、親2人は無残にも焼死
Grim Reaper. It's like a car tool. I said a car to guys, so don't be surprised if the house goes down. up into a little bed. <laughs> and, wow, we made it to the end. This is the good ending, the bad ending, who knows? I'm assuming this is to save, so let's, yes, let's save. Alright, that was pretty awesome, guys. Dark Tales from the Lost Soul was actually pretty fun. I mean, I like, I like the fact that it's divided into three short stories. I mean, we got to do one story, so it was pretty cool to just enjoy the actual gameplay, the playthrough. It was fun. I actually enjoyed it. So as far as my ratings are concerned, I'm going to say as far as the um, 
the sound, the music, it was pretty awesome. I give that a 9. It give you that little eerie feeling for its time, you know, it's PS1. For its time, though, that was pretty cool. It gives you that um, anticipation of what's going to happen or what suspense you're going to be going through. As far as the graphics, graphics were cool. I like the graphics. I mean, they're, they weren't like um, pop at your face type graphics, but they make the game nice and dark, nice and mysterious, or, you know, all, all around. The playthrough was pretty cool. You know, the controls aren't that hard to handle. Yeah, you can encounter some patterns you gotta memorize or get or be ready to use, but other than that, that was pretty cool. The patterns were awesome. I liked the way it went there. The, the overall presentation was sweet, you know. The way you're running into the audience here in that um, Twin Peaks style of presentation. Or even like New Velvet, you know, that whole lounge style with the audience, and you got those distractions by a lady with a parrot, that with a baseball glove. You know, a lot of these little distractions while the host is explaining what's going to happen or what's taking place. But overall, it was pretty cool. All I had to say is I definitely recommend it. I do recommend. Um, Dark Tales, you know, for sure. That's one one thing I would recommend is that game. That was pretty exciting. That was the overall greatness of it. So I do highly recommend Dark Tales from the Lost Soul for the PS1. You guys get it? Or, you know, who knows? I might even bring this to I want to play as a group of friends. <laughs> but for now, that was my uh, review of Dark Tales from the Lost Soul. And if you guys want me to play the other two chapters, definitely comment below and I'll definitely go for it. I'll definitely finish the other two chapters if everybody wants to. I thought that was pretty cool. Again, that was my review of Dark Tales from the Lost Soul for the PS1. Alright, thank you guys all again for tuning in and watching me play this awesome mystery type game. And again, um... If you guys want me to continue it, definitely just leave a comment below or let me know. Just let me, leave me a comment and I'll be more than happy to continue it. I actually had a lot of fun. You know, that was pretty cool and it was a pretty sweet masterpiece. But for now, um, as, as always, if you have a chance, you guys could also catch me on Twitch. I've usually been doing some live streams with other games. Heck, I might even bring some of the games that we do on, the, on these shorter episodes and try to do a long playthrough on to Twitch and, and be streaming them live, so. But for now, though, hope you all have an awesome evening, an awesome day, or an awesome morning, wherever you're at, whichever part of the world you're watching from. And until next time, I'll catch you all on the flip side. <laughs>